Hey man, I'm Chris with Phone Cats, and here is some gameplay for Spoiler Alert. Uh, before we start this game though, I want to give you a spoiler alert that you play this game completely backwards. I've already beat the first, I've already beat the third world, we just unlocked the second. And we're doing the last level. It's so weird. The whole game is literally backwards. Oh god. So I've been playing this a decent amount. I kind of know what I need to do. I don't know where those fireballs are coming from, but... His health bar is filling up. Did I win? I'm so confused. Brr, so cold. Hey, isn't that a red hot chili pepper? Come here, chili pepper. I need you to warm me. Later! Alright, we just beat a boss. Okay, I needed to jump over that guy, since he was still alive. Both of these guys need to be jumped over. If they touch me, it makes something that's called a time paradox, so it messes things up. Oh, I wasn't supposed to get that coin. This game is so weird, dude. One of my favorite parts about it, besides the entire premise, is whenever you die... It's like the best death sound. Oh, that was hard to clear! Alright. Do you get it? If they're dead, then you need to bop them. If they're still alive, that means that you missed them. I need to land on him. And slowly it becomes this confusing little, like, memory game of what you need to do, who needs to die. Wow, how am I gonna hit that? Gotta jump at the last second possible? Because I don't have double jump in this. There we go. Now what? Land on him, jump over him, and it's not even over. Oh, this game is hard, dude. What? Why are they on rocket packs? They're like in rocket bombs. That was bad. Oh no. So that gives those guys a shield. Probably the next level, I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna have to kill them. But it's gonna be a two-stage kill now. This game is so weird, dude. Yeah, Golden Dog Boy and Card Wars. Respect, man. What? What do they want? That is so confusing. Oh dear. Double jump. Boop, boop. Over the spikes. Land on him. I'm gonna have to jump way early. It's like some levels they're trying to teach you Oh, God. How much earlier can I jump? Okay. One, two. Now, jump now. Oh, I shouldn't have got that coin. This level's hard. Now. Boop. 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 No coin. That's confusing. But I can just let that happen? Way weird. Oh god. Oh my god. So now, the deciding factor on if I need to jump is which way those spikes are facing. I need to jump over these, under these, under these, over these, under these. My poor brain. We'll play a couple more though, dude. Oh great, now we got ice blocks. That break and reappear. Look at that fish! What the heck? Ooh. Look like a murloc. 
We'll play a couple more. Hey, Seth, I see you saying this game's boring. It's creative, dude. Look at the premise. There's never been a game like this to where you're doing the game backwards. And if you think this is boring, try to think of other games that you could do this concept to. Hip! 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 That's a big jump. We'll do one more. No. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, I didn't even know that those would break like that. So, no. Yes, yes, yes. Ah! Alright. Last one. Oh, there's spikes underneath those. Sneaky, sneaky. Shouldn't have got that. Alright, man. This has been some gameplay, and the title is Spoiler Alert. This is one of the weirdest games I have ever played on mobile. Um, pick it up, dude. It's cheap. It's not free, but it's just about free. And the dev's creative to even come up with something like this, so show him some love. Ah, I can't jump fast enough there. We'll try it way early. That wasn't early enough. Ah! Yes! That's the end of this video. Thanks for watching. Bone cats.